again. It's a red stick. Welcome back to another video. So it's the 1st of November. So we've got some new Madame Glam colours. So there's eight in the collection this month. But my camera is zoomed right high today because they can just go and play for a second. We've got something so much more exciting. Guys, oh my gosh. So Madame Glam have sent me their advent calendar for this year. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. So I'm going to give you a little sneaky peek. So this is the box. I can't get my camera any further up. Um, I was going to do it on the floor, but no. So this is it. It's huge. So when you open it, I'll show you the lid first. So every month this year, the new collections have been kind of a destination, haven't they? So it's got a map of the world on there. And it says glam is to move, to breathe, to fly, to float, to roam the roads of land remote. I love that. So this is number 25. It's got some sort of cord in there. I'm not gonna pull it out. Oh, sugar, I'm not gonna pull it out. I can't do that. Um, I can't get the lid to stay open. So it's got 24 boxes. So it starts with number five and 13 down here doesn't start with 5 and 13 but they're on the bottom row all different shapes which obviously means there's all different things in all of these um i can't believe it I, i'm dying to have a sneaky peek let me know if any of you have got it already if you've had a sneaky peek private message me <laughs> but yeah um these are available now on the website you can get 30 percent off using my code unpolished 30 I'll leave direct links in my description box. But um, that's all I can show you guys. I can't open any, not until the 1st of December. But um, yeah, I'm so pleased with that. I can't wait to get stuck in. So that is the calendar of this year. I'm liking the, the packaging this year. It's so heavy. I like it. <gasps> anyway, let's get on with it. Right, so... the. <laughs> Back to these. This is four colours from November's collection. I'll leave the write-up on the screen. Um, anyone that doesn't know about Madame Glam, anybody that's new to my channel, Madame Glam gel polishes, they're huge bottles, they're 15ml, and they are all vegan, cruelty-free. They're a 21-free formula, which means that they've got 21 less toxins than what you get in your bog-standard gels. Fantastic. They are palm oil free and they are hemma free. So absolutely brilliant for anybody that has allergies, anyone that's allergic to hemma and all that stuff. They are fantastic quality. Um, so yeah, this is the colours. What are they called? So we've got No Maps, Everglades, Grey Skies and Are We Lost? Yeah, there's eight in the collection this month. I've got four of them. So gonna give them a quick swatch so let's go we're gonna start with no maps the coverage you get from these gels is fantastic I love them so this is like um, a really deep kind of burnt orange isn't it look how creamy and opaque these are guys Wow right these cure in the lamp LED for 30 seconds, UV up to 2 minutes I think it is, but 30 seconds in an LED lamp. Look at this, gorgeous. So that is all the colours there.
from left to right we've got Everglades, no maps, grey skies and are we lost. Do you know what? I quite like this. I do. I quite like that colour. I think they go really well together actually, these four colours. I like the grey, I don't have a shade that colour. I think they go really well together. They definitely scream autumn, don't they? For sure. So I'm going to get some tips out and we'll do a little something with them, shall we? I haven't got a clue what, but that's the Madame Glam No Wipe top coat as well. Super glossy, isn't it? I really like it. Right, let's get some tips out. So I've switched to voiceover, guys. I've got four tips out. So I'm using another colour called Truth, The Truth uh, as, one, as one of my base colours. I love this colour. I, I can see me getting through this bottle pretty quickly because I like it a lot. So I've gave that two coats. I've cured each coat for 30 seconds. The coverage on these gels is just fantastic, isn't it? They're so enjoyable to use. Right, so I've done two tips in that same colour and I'm going to give them a matte top coat. This was one of these sets I completely made up as I went along. So I'm starting with these two tips and I'm just kind of going to do... One of them's going to be a sweater nail and I've pulled some decals out to use as well. So this first nail I'm going to use these two colours, No Maps and Are We Lost? And I'm going to do a sweater nail, yeah, but I'm just going to alt alternate the colours. So I'm going to use Madame Glam's Detail Liner, perfect for these little designs. And I'm just going to do a <laughs> sweater nail. So I'm going to leave a gap in between each of these for the other colour. So it's going to be like a two-tone kind of sweater nail. And then all these little, all these little bits before I cure them, I'm going to sprinkle clear acrylic on them. Just to give you that embossed look. Sweater nail look, I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to sprinkle the acrylic into this and then cure it. And then I'll do the next part. Just so if I make any mistakes, I don't have to wipe the whole thing off. So I'm going to stick that in the lamp and then finish the rest of it. So onto this second nail now, I've pulled out these cute, cute decals that I didn't even know I had. So these are from Decals by Design. They're like little black and white decals that you can colour in. So I'm going to use a bob hat and a jumper. Perfect. <laughs> so I'm going to stick them in some water. Make sure you cut your decals out as close to that image as you can get. So you've not got loads hanging over. So I'll stick them in the water for 10, 20 seconds. I'm going to paint another nail. And I'm going to leave the tacky layer on this. I wanted something tacky for my images to stick to. So that's had two coats. And I'm going to put the image on my stamper face down. Just get some of that excess water off. Slide the back off. And then I am just going to colour it in. Same with the bob hat. I'm just going to colour them in and cure them in the lamp for 30 seconds. So I'm going to get these stuck on this nail now. I'm just, I put the jumper a bit too high up. I wasn't, 
I didn't want it that high up. I'm so fussy, aren't I? Yeah. Can you see how they stick? Because I've put a tacky layer down and I've used gel polish to colour them in instead of stamping polish. You can use stamping polish, you can use any you like. And then use a silicone tool and just make sure all them edges are really stuck down because you don't want any of your top coat to go under it. So I'm using Madame Glam's Velvet Matte Top Coat. I want this set to be matte. So that's going to get cured in the lamp now for 30 seconds. How cute are they? Really like them. And in the gaps, because it was looking a bit plain, I've just added some little dots. And that green colour is Everglades. I added a couple of green dots as well. And then, again, it's going to get another matte top coat. I think I sealed it in with a glossy top coat to start with. I'm not sure. But that's that nail done as well. So this one is having a coat of, what's that one called? Are We Lost? Yep. Look at the coverage on that. I think I only gave that one coat. Fantastic. And this last nail, I'm just doing a little smile line using the Madame Glam gold gel paint. This gold gel paint is stunning. Every time I use it, I mention how sparkly it is. It's beautiful. And it doesn't cure with a tacky layer, so you can leave it sparkly like that. And I'm just going to do a sweater print, same as the first nail on the bottom half of this. Exactly the same as the first nail. So I'm just going to stick this charmy thing on this nail now and that'll be this set done. That's just um, fancy charm, isn't it? Posh charm. <laughs> anyway, guys, that is then finished. I think they're so autumn. Aggie that hates autumn nails. I've done a hell of a lot this year, haven't I? Anyway, guys, that is it for today. Don't forget you can get 30% off using my code. It's all in my description box with all my other codes and links and good stuff. Please remember to give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And hopefully, I'll see you in my next one. Take care. Bye.